No, it's high school, isn't it? Oh, we're coming into high school. But I wanted to um, get a little bit of a world view at that, at that time. So any time between 1919 and, say, 1929, in your first 10 years, do you remember who was president at that time? <laughs> Franklin D. Roosevelt. I didn't think there would ever be another president. I mean, he just, for eight years, all eight years I was in grade school, he was president. So and then by the time I got into high school, I was, had more other interests, more than I never thought about it much until, mm -hmm. until I got out of high school and got into working and so forth. Mm -hmm. Then you start <laughs> voting and knowing no, what's going on. Of, a lot of things were happening during that time. Um, and Eleanor Roosevelt too, who was very um, iconic in our in our history as a, uh, an active woman in the government too. Yeah, right. An active first lady. Uh -huh. Yeah, as, as uh, Mrs. Roosevelt. Mm -hmm. Very much so. Yeah. Um, Amelia Earhart. And, 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 yeah, who were yeah. who were those? Amelia Earhart. I mean, we had that time. the only communications we had <laughs> was the radio, of course, the radio and newspapers. Mm -hmm. and that's how we got our, our information. Uh -huh. And when you're younger, you don't pay too much attention to that until you get older. Right. But you'd hear all those special things that would happen. And, and I can remember hearing about the 1929. Uh, Crash, a depression crash. You remember hearing about that? When all the wealthy people lost their interest. The, I mean, they were. They were they that was 1929. They committed suicide. They lost everything. But it didn't affect us any <laughs> particular because we didn't have any money to invest. You know, I mean, we were just living the same. So that part didn't bother me. You know, we didn't know too much about it. It's interesting. Except uh -huh. it didn't actually affect us. Ordinary people that were just, mm -hmm. I don't think, yeah. I don't think, people didn't have investments in those years like they do now, you know. I see. <laughs> there wasn't any money. So life went on the same. But you did hear about um, world events. Oh, yes, yeah, you did hear, newspaper you'd hear about them, but you didn't worry about them or think too much about them mm -hmm. at that age. And news reels at the movies, yeah. right? Well, yeah, we get, uh, yeah, we go for the movie, it would be. And by the way, at that time, too, when my si sister was playing in the dance orchestra, she also played for silent movies. She did? We had silent movies. And, you know, we had them in Gordon's Hall. No, I didn't know that. I can remember being up there, coming <laughs> in, our, in our building. Yeah. It would be up there. Silent movies. And she never could have her music. She just had to play by ear because there was never a light on of any kind. Mm -hmm. And I can remember the Western movies when the horses were going, she... Certain certain pieces I can remember certain pieces she played when the horses were running, <laughs> creating excitement. Yeah, or, excitement. How mm -hmm. interesting. Um, another um, celebrity at that time I think was Charles Lindbergh. Do you remember? Oh yes, when his, ba when his baby was uh, uh, was uh, abducted. And, oh yes. And then he f did the first transatlantic flight. Oh yeah. So you mm -hmm. do remember hearing about that? Oh yeah, that. I remember hearing about it. See, they didn't mean too much to me. Either. Okay. Um, do you remember, did your dad have a car? Did you guys, <laughs> how did you get it around? My, my dad never had a car until I was a senior in high school because he would not buy one until he could pay cash for it. And uh, <laughs> there were no such thing as credit cards. I mean, maybe there were. We sure didn't have any anyway. And I can remember he, he bought this little uh, Ford two-door Ford uh, for $500. Can you believe that? And it was new? A brand new car at $500. <laughs> but that $500 took a long time to save, I'll tell you. Because he was sending, he sent all my sisters through college. My three older sisters, one was a nurse, the other two were teachers. Wow. And then I came along and he sent me to school. <laughs> Ready? 